MC Red here. It's been long that I'm not uploading a video. Sorry about that because I'm doing my assignments. Anyways, I'm going to show you on how to make another redstone in Minecraft Pot Edition. Now, go to a redstone world, which is very good to my redstone. Um, kind of modified some things. I'm gonna make a video on elevators coming soon, so don't worry about that. They'll be coming soon. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make this one a sliding door. And then you can go in here, and then there'll be a button. You can close it too and open it too. But if this happens, like here and then you're a tree over here, it kind of sometimes like it won't work. Like, it will be like when you press it, it won't close or open. If that top happens, he did another. Hit the button again so it will so it will be fixed. So yeah, I'm gonna show you how to build this. So I'm not gonna say the materials because I'm too lazy. They lazy, lazy to say it. So need a dropper. Start the materials we red snow over here. Blocks of your choice. And yeah. So first one do is place them. Two sticky pistons. So here, then over here, then so the piston will be here and over here. These two blocks over there. That next. Place where the the normal person was placed to rest them above it. Next, we're gonna make two blocks of here and another one. Break that over there, and this is what you get. Next. You need to do now is I don't memorize this stuff. Sorry. Oh no. Don't. Okay. So next, get out your two sticky pistons and. Yeah, get your two sticky pistons and okay, sticky piston. Uh, oh my goodness, it's so hard to memorize. Redstone over there. Okay. See over here. Um, a sticky piston facing this way. 
block over there, then obsidian over there. Please, two blocks over here, two blocks over here, and then over here, piston, piston downwards, break, break that block, the one that you place, and then over here, oh, here, break that block. I'm trying to get a new camera, a screen recorder actually. Um, yeah, so that's that's what you need to do next. After that, you need to do is get your sticky pistons and do these pistons needs to be facing this way. So two blocks like that, sticky piston facing that way. And other piston facing this way. Then break those two blocks, all of them, and do do the same thing in this other side. There go. Next, after that, need to do now is. These two blocks over here. Yeah. Two blocks over here, there, and then one block over here. Place two redstone, four redstone over there. Oh, oh. Sorry if it doesn't work. I'm actually finding a screen recorder, but I'm in iOS 8.4, so I can't find one. Two redstone over there. Get your redstone repeater. Put redstone repeater facing that way. Redstone repeater facing that way. Put it. Put those redstone repeaters in four ticks. There we go. Up there, next after that, okay, after that. Get your redstone. Put redstone going there, and the redstone going there. Next, um, yeah, break that block and place like that. Place on that, that, and then. Next is this other one, so it's like a lever one when you press, you know, where you press a button, it will just up and then off. And this one, you're gonna make the button into a lever, so get your dropper button. Stone slab, redstone repeater, redstone, and redstone comparator, redstone, a hopper, and there we go. Then something to place in, like just one. Now, to your side, where you're gonna put it, um, mine, I'm gonna put it over here. So yeah. Next, so read the block. So I'm to go block. Oh, if the one that you want to place in there, I recommending putting all 
of your block of your choice the one that you want to be covered over here like that because I don't even usually know what it is so here we go so you need is you have a piston over here place one block over there and a slab over here try and get this next that get your rest of the facing this way rest of the back facing that way and then a dropper facing this way next get your blocks and then this dropper facing upwards get your blocks again this dropper facing downwards there we go, downwards now break on the break this because this rest will be broken if we have other blocks in with it so Get your hopper and shift. You need to be shift. So you will open it. Press this block. Go. You have that. Next, watch closely. This block over here. This one. The one over here. The one I'm facing right now. And circle. Press that. Put anything. Just one. There we go. Then you come up this. Make sure all of this is covered like square. There we go. That means it it's working. When that happens, means it works. So that's good. Next, we need to do now is place get two blocks. Put one over there and break those two. After that. Place one redstone over there. Break one. There you go. Two. Place two blocks over there. Like that. And then that. And place rest. Place this rest with rest. There you go. Now you can. It's your choice. If you can make it even longer. Or you can put it just right there. Just right there. Like that. As you can see. It's your choice. So then over here to the side. It's your choice if you want to put it somewhere. There we go. Look, watch. So if I want to put it over here, like oh, very, very, very long. One. Very, very long. You can see. But make sure you have a redstone. Repeat this way in case it won't reach. This one reached because as you can see it's not too long. As you can see you can do anything with it. Now you need to fill it in. Now over here you place two blocks over there. Don't make this one covered or else it will break. Fill it in. That. Make sure all the redstone are not seen. Same in this side. And there you have it. That's your redstone sliding door. Oh. Make sure not all of it that's covered. Sorry. But make sure not all of this are not covered. Oh no, I don't know what happened. Don't make the one that I did. That the covering one. But what I'm very sure is covering this floor over there. So yeah, thanks for watching and don't make sure you won't copy what I did by like covering covering it all. You need to find a way to make that really memorize it. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like it is and make sure to watch my first video. So yeah.
Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're just new or blah blah blah. And see you guys in the next video.